today multiverses has revealed um agent smith and jason Voorhees coming to the game and it eventually led me to find a list of nine characters that should be part of the game and my the one i chose for number nine is the powerpuff girls they kick butt they're cute they're cartoonish and they their terror strong voices one of them and it's part of cartoon network and it's a very popular cartoon network ip so they, it makes very much sense to include them into the game and it will be fun to play one of them if they play them as separate or as three of them will be awesome and of course that they were in lego dimensions so it would be very cute for them to return Number 8 to me is Freddy Krueger. We have Jason Voorhees. Why not have Freddy Krueger? He's also owned by Warner Bros. or New Line Cinema. Have Freddy and Jason in a family-friendly cartoonish video game, if that's interesting. Couldn't have both of them together in Mortal Kombat, so it would be fine to have them in multiverse, I guess. Number seven, the mask. He perfectly fits the tone of the care of the game, for the cartoonish and the action-packed way. Cause he can kick people's butts in cartoonish ways. Like he can attack them with a hammer, like it with the clock in the mask movie. So I think it will be uh, hilarious. And I wonder if someone else can impersonate Jim Carrey because I doubt Jim Carrey will reprise the role in the game. Uh, but that's my number seven. The Mask! Number six to me is Harry Potter. Uh, he's a Warner Bros. IEP, yes, also. But he's also extremely popular with both the books and the films. And he can be a very cool addition to the to the roster where he, we can fight him with his wand and we he can do some interesting magic and and he can have different skins from different costumes like the reversible outfit uh, like the red outfit or like the traditional clothes or like the clothes that were at that we saw him as Daniel Radcliffe introduced in the first movie. Um, or even like the rate, the one, the costume that he wears during the racing, during the flying in Goblet of Fire. Who knows? There's so much potential for Harry Potter. Uh, next up is Space Ghost. It's very interesting because they could do like a version of like the original cartoon, but they could have the voice of Space Ghost George Lowe to reprise the role to add some comedic and goofy mo goofy dialogue for the character if Lowe if George is still available for to voice the character. And he will have some awesome flying abilities and powers. To attack your opponent. And Space Ghost is one of those characters that I really enjoy. And it's an important part of my channel. So if he comes to the game. I immediately have to get him to play him. Next up is Daffy Duck. Come on. If you're gonna have Bugs Bunny. Why can't you have... Daffy Duck. I mean, like, he's the most important Looney Tunes else other than Bugs Bunny. And so that's my other one. Next up is Daenerys from Game of Thrones, who I think is the most fan favorite of all the Game of Thrones characters. I have not watched Game of Thrones, but I played, uh, like, the character that from Game of Thrones in the game. And she was fun a little, for a little bit. That I played her in. It. And I think the nurse would make a very interesting character if Amelia Carver would prize the role. She's probably the fan favorite of the show, like I said. 
And I want I have not watched Game of Thrones, so I don't know what her ability would be like. Next up is Neo from the Matrix. We have Agent Smith. I wonder, I, I mean, I don't know if he's a we will reprise the role, but I would love Keanu Reeves to reprise the role. And But Keanu, but Neo would also be a cool one where you can fly uh, or even shoot guns or even do bullet stop like he does in the films. Like, he is truly awesome character and would perfect for this, for the sh- sh- the game. But my number one to me is Samurai Jack. He is probably the most, the one that we all think should be the most character that should be in it alongside Ben 10, Teen Titans, and other ones. But Samurai Jack is needed to be part of the game. He kicks butt. He has a cartoonish animation. He has some very cool video games that I have not played. That are similar and the most recent game, Battle Through Chimes, has similar animation uh, graphic style to multiverses. So I think it is better to have Samurai Jack be part of the game. And if Phil Amaro reprise the role, or even they can bring Aku and have Greg Ball in return, that would be epic. So, that is my list of characters from the Warner Brothers to be part of multiverse. This Samurai Jack, Neo, Daenerys from Game of Thrones, Daffy Duck, Space Ghost, Harry Potter, The Mask, Freddy Krueger, and the power cup girl so what do you think should be part of multiverses let me know in the comments below peace out bye